Alright guys, what is up? And uh, this game's coming in partly late because I had to go turn on my PVR to grab this game, but I actually, uh, we ran into a lobby against uh, someone who I'm actually subscribed to. He's a fairly big commentator. He has 35,000 subs, I believe, and uh, his name is Bob Blah Blah, and uh, he's pretty big for the tutorials, and uh, he's a pretty big beast in the Call of Duty community. And uh, me, and I'm not sure if we're in a full party. I believe we're in a party of four. I believe, yeah, I think we're in a party of four. We ran into a party of... Uh, him and two other guys on his friends list, and uh, I must say he actually is a pretty decent player, and I do respect the guy, but we're just going toe-to-toe, -to -toe, us four against his like team of three, but I don't know, I thought it was a cool gameplay to put up, just, just something different, you know, different than the average, you know, just me destroying a team or something like that, I'm not trying to sound cocky, but most of the gameplays that people post are, you know, they're good games, so uh, this game was decent, but you know, I just thought it was something different. You guys wouldn't mind it. But, something that I find interesting, or that I've been thinking of lately, is the dashboard. And the dashboard is on the PlayStation as well. It's All you have to do is sign out of the PlayStation Network in the middle of a game. And you guys know what dashboarding a game is. It's uh, where you leave the game partway through. Not just by leaving the game, but by uh, going to the uh, dashboard of the Xbox 360. Or uh, going to, uh, or just signing out of the PlayStation Network uh, in the middle of a game or something like that, or before you're gonna lose. And uh, a lot of people don't really have a problem with it, but I really do because I base myself on my win loss, and it's really been bugging me a lot lately. And uh, I hope for Black Ops 2 now. I don't think they'll be able to do this, but they have it done in Halo, which is really cool. But they need to take the dashboard system out, so. The game needs to record the stats as they are. So, you know, say your uh, team's losing at the last minute, you dashboard a game, and, you know, it, it doesn't count as anything. You know, your kills and deaths don't count, your win and loss doesn't count, you know. I think that's bullcrap because uh, when someone else hosts, everyone in the game gets a loss, even if you're about to win. So, only the host doesn't record it for, for like, anything. Which I think is some pretty uh, retired stuff because. I was in a game the other day, I believe it was on Underground, and uh, I went about 30, I think I went like 30 kills and like 41 deaths, probably the worst game I've actually ever had. Well, not really the worst, I, I, you know, I was playing the objective like crazy, we were going against this party of six, and we were in a party of six, and man, it was a really close game. I was running my support class, my tryhard attack and sir class, and you know, it was just complete, uh, complete beastifying between both teams and at the last second at 197 in the domination game uh, the host dashboard and you know it gave me a loss for that and uh, it's kind of bullcrap and you guys can see right here my friend Dempsey it's Dempsey who by the way is a beast he drops a Moab on blah 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 and uh, on his squad which is kind of impressive I'm not technically like, trying to take a shot at Bob or anything like that he's a pretty good player clearly but that's why I'm saying, uh, you guys can see he left the game, didn't dashboard, he just left the game normally. And that's why I have respect for someone like that who just leaves the game, not dashboarding. Now, uh, that's, pr that's what I want to kind of cover for this commentary. I, I don't know, I just think it's kind of bullcrap. What do you guys think about it? Uh, you always see people dashboarding when you're doing good. It's always, you know, it can never be when you're doing bad. It's always when you're, like, doing good. It's because the other team gets fed up with you and they dashboard, which is kind of, uh, kind of silly if you ask me. But uh, I like to give a shout out to uh, Dempsey. I don't know if he even watches my videos, but uh, he actually, uh, we ran into two different YouTubers, or three different YouTubers in three different days, or in two different days, sorry. Uh, uh, yesterday we ran into Bob, and uh, we actually dropped a Moab on him. And uh, at the end of the game, I actually sent him a message just saying, good game, and uh, I respect you, and, you know, I'm a sub, and that's all I said to him. He didn't reply back, uh, clearly, well, obviously, the big YouTube commentator, they don't have time for small people, right? But, uh, anyways, I sent him a message at the end of the game saying good game, and the day before that, we actually ran into, uh, God of Death 89 another YouTube commentator with, I believe, at least 20,000 subs, and we made, we made him rage quick, quickly, we dropped a Moab on him, too, which is kind of funny that we're actually dropping Moabs on these YouTubers, and, uh, I don't know. I, I have a feeling that they've never been Moab before. I'm not saying, like, I'm not bragging or acting cocky. Because I actually didn't get the Moab in this game. I dropped the Moab on God of Death, though. Uh, but I'm, I'm not saying anything. I'm not taking anything away from the guys. They're really good players. But, you know, sometimes you get lucky and you get on a little bit of a streak. That's all I'm saying here. 
And uh, earlier that day we ran into uh, Optic Merc and uh, another Optic, and they actually were the real Optics, and uh, they were actually trying pretty hard, and uh, we uh, we beat them uh, on Arcadin too. But uh, I just thought it was kind of cool uh, that we actually uh, faced three different YouTubers. What's the odds that I got into a lobby with three different YouTubers? Uh, I don't know, I thought it was kind of cool. But uh, anyways guys, here's just proof it's the real guy. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I will have the uh, next live com session up for Black Ops coming up soon, next day or two. Uh, but anyways, hopefully you guys enjoy this late night commentary, and uh, have a nice night, guys. Peace.